Imagine a tiny fragile vessel launched from Earth in 1977, Voyager 2. Its mission, a grand tour of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. But Voyager 2 didn't stop there. It kept going, propelled by the sun's fading pull and its own momentum. It sailed beyond everything we knew, heading for the unknown between the stars. Voyager 2 is a testament to human curiosity, a bottle cast into the cosmic sea. On board is the golden record sounds, images, greetings and music from Earth, a snapshot of who we are. For decades, Voyager 2 sent back breathtaking images. Jupiter's storms, Saturn's rings, Uranus's tilt, Neptune's blue winds. It turned distant worlds into real places, our remote eyes and ears in the solar system. After its planetary mission, it just kept flying, a lonely sentinel pushing into the dark. Now in August 2025, Voyager 2 is over 13 billion miles from home. Light takes nearly a day to reach it. It has crossed the heliopause, the invisible boundary where the sun's influence ends. Voyager 2 now sails the interstellar medium, the space between stars. It's a true pioneer, tasting the cosmic winds between suns. Our silent ambassador to the galaxy, it carries our message into the vast unknown. Voyager 2 represents our desire to explore, to learn, and to connect with the universe. It's a symbol of hope, curiosity, and the enduring reach of human ingenuity. Out there it continues its journey, our tiny ship on a cosmic ocean. Before Voyager 2 left the solar system, scientists wondered what it would find at the edge. We imagined the heliosphere's boundary as a turbulent, noisy frontier, where the sun's wind clashed with the galaxy. Theories pictured a cosmic shoreline full of waves and chaos. We expected Voyager 2's instruments to detect sudden changes, plasma density, magnetic fields, cosmic rays. Would it be a place of chaos or something else entirely? Voyager 2 and its twin, Voyager 1, were our messengers to this unknown. Every signal was precious, a whisper from unexplored territory. The anticipation was immense, the data would rewrite our textbooks. But the truth turned out to be quieter, more mysterious than we imagined. Voyager 2 was about to reveal a universe far subtler than our wildest predictions. Sometimes, the greatest discoveries come not with a roar, but with a whisper. The crossing into interstellar space wasn't dramatic. On November 5, 2018, Voyager 2's plasma science experiment noticed the solar wind drop to zero. For over 40 years, it had swum in a river of solar particles. Then, suddenly, the river was gone. This was the heliopause. The sun's influence ended, and the galaxies began. Voyager 2 had left home, entering a realm shaped by ancient distant stars. The transition was smooth, no wall of energy, just a gentle passage. The magnetic field grew stronger, aligning with the galaxy's field. The spacecraft was now sailing the deep tides of the Milky Way. This quiet crossing told us the solar system's edge is serene, not chaotic. The heliosphere is a remarkably effective shield, creating a calm bubble for our planets. Voyager 2's journey gave us our first direct evidence of this boundary. It was a message from the void, revealing the true nature of our cosmic home. The edge of our solar system is not a stormy border but a tranquil frontier. Voyager 2's passage changed our understanding of where we live in the galaxy. Sometimes the universe's most profound secrets are revealed in silence. The silence of space isn't just the absence of sound, it's the absence of almost everything. Scientists listen for plasma waves, the hum of charged particles. Inside the solar system, the plasma buzzes with the solar wind's activity. As Voyager 2 crossed into interstellar space, that hum faded to near nothing. The plasma density was lower than expected and emptiness more complete than we'd imagined. This was the true silence of deep space, not just quiet but almost absolute stillness. The interstellar medium just outside our solar system is calm and uniform. The cosmic winds are gentle, the great ocean between stars more like a placid lake. Voyager 2 was our first witness to this unexpected peace. The silence is humbling, a reminder of the vast, empty distances between stars. Out there the universe whispers, not shouts. We need sensitive instruments to hear anything at all. The silence itself is a message, a profound one. In the great dark even emptiness can teach us. So what did Voyager 2 actually detect in the quiet? The solar wind vanished, but galactic cosmic rays surged, high-energy particles from ancient supernovae. Our sun's magnetic bubble had shielded us. Now, Voyager 2 was exposed to the raw galaxy. The magnetic field outside was stronger, more orderly, aligned with the Milky Way's grand current. Voyager 2 was now feeling the galaxy's pull, not just the sun's. Occasionally its instruments picked up faint ethereal hums, echoes of our sun's energy striking the interstellar plasma. These rare sounds are whispers from home, heard across the cosmic shore. 
the data revealed a new environment, raw, ancient, and beautiful in its quiet. Even in silence, the universe has stories to tell. Voyager 2's instruments let us listen. Decades after launch, billions of miles away, Voyager 2 still talks to us. Its radio signal is unimaginably faint, billions of times weaker than a watch battery. Only the largest radio antennas on Earth, like those of the Deep Space Network, can hear it. Communicating is a cosmic dance. A message takes over 22 hours each way. Every bit of data is precious, our only direct window into the interstellar medium. Voyager 2 measures plasma, magnetic fields, cosmic rays, building a new map of our galactic neighborhood. Its technology is ancient, its memory tiny, yet it endures. The spacecraft continues to execute commands, gather data, and phone home from unimaginable distance. It's a triumph of engineering and persistence. Voyager 2 is a symbol of human ingenuity and endurance. Its faint voice reminds us how far curiosity can reach. Even in the cold, silent dark, we can still hear a whisper from home. Our reach extends farther than we ever dreamed. What does Voyager 2's journey mean for our dreams of traveling to the stars? The emptiness it found is daunting, vast, cold, and quiet. Interstellar travel means centuries through a void with no ports or gas stations. The high levels of cosmic radiation are a major challenge. Voyager 2 can survive but humans would need powerful shielding. Any future starship must carry its own protective bubble, a miniature heliosphere. The silence is not peaceful for life, it's dangerous. Yet the calm interstellar medium might make navigation easier than we thought. Understanding the galactic magnetic field could inspire new propulsion ideas. By sending robotic pioneers, we learn before we leap. Voyager 2 is our first cartographer of the interstellar seas. The silence should inspire, not discourage us. There is a vast, mysterious ocean to explore. The silence is an invitation, to build, to protect, and to journey onward. Voyager 2's journey has answered some questions but opened up even more. We now know the edge of our solar system is quiet and vast, but what lies beyond? Is all interstellar space this calm, or did Voyager 2 find a special patch? The mystery has only deepened. Voyager 2 will drift for millennia, a silent ambassador carrying our golden record. It's a testament to a species that dared to reach for the stars. This is the heart of science, casting a line into the unknown. Voyager 2's journey transforms our perspective, making us feel small, yet significant. We are the universe's way of knowing itself. Next time you look at the night sky, think of Voyager 2, sailing silently between the stars. It is a piece of us, a symbol of curiosity and imagination. The universe is vast, and the silence Voyager 2 found is not an ending. It's a beginning, an open invitation to keep exploring, keep listening, and always wonder. The journey continues, and so does our quest for understanding.